Hey, Radiance here. Let's check a calendar view made with React at increaser.org so that you can find some interesting bits for your project. Here we have an interface showing work sessions for the last seven days. The start and end of work for a selected day and a green area highlighting time for rest. I call the component group by day sessions. At the top level it has two sections, navigation between days and the calendar view itself. The container with lines and hours is a separate component that is also used to display work sessions of the current day. We pass the start and end hours to the component, width of our labels and content to show under the lines. In our case, this content is the green area at the bottom. The container of the hour space component is a relatively positioned flexbox component. We render underlined content and children in absolutely positioned wrappers with a left offset preventing content from overlaying our labels. Once we pass all the props to the hour space component, we can iterate over every day and display work sessions. And the sessions container component takes full height and has flex set to 1 so that every other one will have the same width. Every session is an absolutely positioned element with the color of a corresponding project. To calculate the top and height attributes, we don't need to know the parent's height in pixels. We know the number of hours we display and our sessions have start and end denominated in timestamps. Therefore, we can convert everything to milliseconds and divide it by the timeline in milliseconds variable. That's all. Stay productive.